good morning guys welcome back to another video it is currently 7 34 in the morning and i thought we could do a little morning routine aiden has just left for work made him his scrambled egg his tea i've just washed up everything and i'm actually gonna head out i feel like i've said it so many times but if you guys haven't been watching my most recent vlogs then i have actually changed my hours and my little admin job so i'm now what? a full oh how did the camera just move that was weird but i am now full time so i actually start work at nine instead of eight which has been a really lovely change i mean we're only on to the third day of it but so far i am thoroughly enjoying my more relaxed mornings i feel like i have so much more productive days now so this morning i'm actually giving up as you can tell i would normally be in my dressing gown right now but I need to take a little walk down to the in-post lockers to post a couple of vintage parcels. And I did go yesterday, but the guy was like delivering loads of parcels and I didn't want to be annoying. So I just walked away. I don't know why, like, I feel like maybe I should have just gone up to the locker and just asked him if I could have put them in. But I guess it's what you get when you're like me. So we're going to go out this morning, which is fine getting more steps getting a little nice walk in the morning but we need to get going because i i want to try and get there before he gets there that's if he's even gonna go there today this is the ootd to go post our parcels i'm hoping it's not too cold outside the gilet is actually from boohoo i absolutely love it but i don't think they sell it anymore so let's go get some steps in and hopefully post the vintage parcels otherwise i'm gonna have to walk really far to another locker which i i don't want to do guys i literally just got here and i think the the vans just got here for the deliveries oh things i don't, like they're so busy and i don't want to <laughs> i don't like interfere so that's gonna be very annoying i mean i just saw him turn the corner and that's where the lockers are so i could just i just have a feeling that he's not gonna go fill up petrol i have a feeling he is parking up at the lockers <laughs> guys i was wrong he hasn't parked up which means that he isn't coming to the lockers. I'm not gonna lie, I did not feel like walking all the way in the other direction to um to post these parcels. So thank the Lord. I'm honestly so happy I managed to take that off my to-do list because I've needed to do it for a couple of days. However, I am now just walking home with a bloody massive tote bag. Free soul sent it to me and it's so big, it's so good, but a little bit awkward. We you know anything in it, but I decided to come home the scenic way through the lake i mean i say scenic it's not really that great today because there's like no sun although the sun is peeking out behind the clouds so hopefully we get another sunny day i just feel like the sun puts me in such a good mood and i was thinking yesterday i'm just not ready for the dark mornings the dark afternoons the gloomy weather i don't mind having cold crisp autumn winter days but it's just when it's gray yeah, I'm not feeling it. We are home and I'm actually really warm. It's very warm outside, but I only did a little bit of walking around the lake. I was going to do a full lap of the lake, then I thought, do you know what? I haven't done any kind of working out in the last month and a half, to be completely honest with you guys. So I thought, whilst I have a bit of spare time, I would just do a little home workout. I mean, I need to try and find a weight. So I have no idea where they could be, but yeah. Let's do a little home workout. Only like 20 minutes. I'm not gonna go and do anything crazy. Wish me luck because I'm probably so weak now. Just another sunny day in Southern California. It's where the people came to play. now 8 31 and i've just finished my little workout honestly have not done anything like i said for six or seven weeks which is not ideal but i just i just needed the break i just was not feeling working out you're gonna have to excuse me getting all of the washing out of the linen basket but i do need to do a little wash today i also did a little bit of stretching which again i have not stretched in so blooming long like honestly way too long but i need to start doing more ab workouts because i have my pilates like training course like the practicals coming up 
in the next couple of weeks i think they actually pushed it back which was really annoying so i'm like two weeks behind schedule but obviously pilates has a lot of abs it is honestly mainly abs like i haven't been going to my pilates classes because they're just so expensive i would like to start going to like one a month though but the ab strength that a pilates class takes is honestly unreal and if you're going to be an instructor i feel like you need to have solid strength it's not about obviously having six packs or anything like that but just like the internal strength pilates takes is a lot so I need to start doing some ab workouts like every day just to start building it all up again but i'm just gonna go put on a white wash because my mum has some white so I'm just gonna chuck all of this in with hers and get a coffee we can finally have a coffee now that the workout is done. Coffee has been acquired. I cannot wait until Aiden and I move out and we have our own little coffee machine. Because fun fact, we've actually already bought a coffee machine. I don't know if that's a little bit too far, but it was just on a really good deal. We got a Tassimo as well, which I feel like not many people get. We used to have one when I was younger, but I just feel like the drinks options out of a Tassimo are so much better than all of like the other coffee machines because we've got chai lattes that Aiden loves, hot chocolates, coffee. You can also do tea out of them. I don't really get the point of it. I guess if you don't have a kettle, then you can just grab like the hot water out. But I'm just gonna spend the next 10 minutes drinking my coffee and just having a little bit of me time before I start work. Obviously I've been pretty go, go, go all this morning. So yes, we're just gonna chill for a little bit. I literally haven't even done any scroll on my phone, which I'm actually happy about. I really wanna get back into reading instead of scrolling. And as you guys know, I've been obsessed with Animal Crossing recently. So that's really been keeping, well, I say it's been keeping my screen time down. It's been keeping my screen time down on my phone. Obviously have been on a switch though, but then we can obviously get ready for the day and jump on to work. The plan of action for the day is obviously start work at nine, which is literally in 10 minutes. So I need to get a little bit of a move on. And then when I finish at five, I am going to film some hair videos. Hence why I'm doing my makeup now, because at least if I do it now, then it is all done and I can literally just start filming straight away. I think for dinner tonight, we are also having like a potato chicken salad situation so i need to remember to take some chicken out of the freezer otherwise we will not be having any of that makeup is all done so what i need to do later is maybe give my hair a quick little straighten because it's a little bit it's not that slick is it but it is now time to jump onto work log in say good morning to everyone let's get on with it I was just about to go and grab some breakfast, but I just had a little parcel turn up. So I thought we could do a mini unboxing. I've got no idea what is in here. So I can only assume Ooh, it is PR. Oh, face bond. Wait, this looks cool. It looks like a magazine in here. Let's get out the box. I can't get it out. <laughs> oh my God, wait, this is so cool. It's like a fake magazine this is so useful you could definitely keep this three in one foundation <gasps> urban decay meet your match wait why is this so cool so we've got the face bond foundation which i haven't if i'm honest i haven't heard about this waterproof foundation up to 24 hour wear we love that so we got scent light medium which is cool olive which i'm thinking should be okay it could be a bit oh Mm, it looks like it might be a little bit pale for me. What are we thinking? But that is a lovely packaging. And then what's this? Face bond available in 40 units. <gasps> Wait, this is also so cool. It's like a little chart of how many colours they have got. And it shows you all of the, all the things. And like what they look like so what have we got we got number 13 oh my gosh i'm literally creating such a fuss right now so we got light medium olive i wonder if number 15 might have been a bit of a better match maybe even light medium cool number 16 
they do look very light yeah those would have been too dark hmm. we'll have to try it and see what it is but let me show you the darker shades these ones are like more of the darker colors which to be fair i mean obviously i can't talk from experience but i feel like it's pretty good i mean i feel like we could go a bit further but i'm kind of obsessed that they sent this because then you can really tell what other colors they have and then we've got the og long lasting makeup set and spray this is so good and i love these little ones because they're like mini travel ones which is so handy to put into your makeup bag and finally they sent a little sponge i have not used a makeup sponge in so long so maybe this is my sign to do that again but thank you so much urban decay for sending that i'm actually going to keep this because i feel like i can take out this insert brilliant and now i've got this as like a little storage box or something and i feel like that looks pretty cool so i'm going to keep this thanks so much urban decay but let's go grab some breakfast it is 10 34 which is like prime breakfast time for me one thing i will never take for advantage working from home is the fact that I can eat breakfast and lunch and basically anything at any time of the day which i'm not gonna lie when i was looking for new jobs i that was like my main issue was the fact that i was gonna have to eat breakfast at like 7 a.m which if you guys have been watching me for a while just is not feasible for me when i was younger i used to have to eat as soon as i opened my eyes which is what aiden is like but now eating before 10 just does not appeal to me i don't really know what it is that made me change my mind either i mean i used to intermittent fast when i was like 18 or 19 so i don't know if it was that or if it's just like getting older which makes me sound like i'm about to be 50 i am only 25 but now i'm a late morning breakfast gal got a bit of a, a, bit of a dodgy hit oh click oh click but you guys guessed it i am having oh hello my camera's having issues focusing I don't like that but today i'm having oh there is a hair in the bowl i'm having my white chocolate and raspberry muffin with half a little protein pudding i feel like i should start experimenting again with different flavors of the protein of the protein muffins of the oat muffins but i just know that i love the white chocolate and raspberry one so i don't really want to change i did used to have apple and cinnamon but once I tried this one, I was like, no, this one's so much better. I did also try to do lemon and blueberry before and it did not go well. They did not taste good. If anyone has any other suggestions, please let me know. I really just can't think of what would taste good apart from white chocolate and raspberry. I've literally just been reminded of when Aiden and I were in Australia and we had this muffin top from this bakery. Oh my goodness. It was incredible. White chocolate and raspberry muffin top with like ice and sugar. Oh. I'm gonna go eat my healthy version of it. It's not as good, but that was so good. I feel like my morning routine is technically over now because the next thing I'm gonna do is eat my lunch. So I hope that you all did enjoy coming along on my little morning with me. If there's any other videos that you guys wanna see, then let me know down below. Otherwise, we're just gonna be sticking to the why in the days, the vlogs. So yeah, let me know if there's anything in particular you'd like to see from me and I will see you all very soon in a new video. Bye.